The idea of shifting baselines is very simple. It's just that every generation uh, comes to uh, a consensus about what's normal based on what they see, and things keep getting worse and worse, so every generation takes uh, as a new normal a degraded state. So for example, I started studying coral reefs in 1974, a long time ago, and when I started studying them in Jamaica, the uh, corals were very common. They really covered the bottom, almost 70% of the bottom was living coral. And so that's my concept of what is a, a, a normal reef. Students who go out to look at reefs now are lucky to find 10% of the bottom covered with living coral, and for them, that's a normal reef. And of course, the same process that's happening even with students and scientists, it's also, of course, happening with the public at large. They get used to ever more degraded ecosystems and then call them normal. And as a consequence, our standards keep declining. Uh, you have to go to really remote places now to see what the true baseline is. For example, in the middle of the Pacific, which is um, on islands which are so remote that they're really not fished or otherwise bothered, 80% uh, of the living uh, biomass is our apex predators, uh, big sharks and groupers, things like that. And no reef anywhere near people has anything like that uh, structure of, in terms of an e ecosystem. And we simply, we never even thought it was possible because we'd gotten so used to looking at reefs where essentially we'd eaten all the big stuff and just the little stuff was left. That's the essence of a shifting baseline.